टूडे आवर टॉपिक इज फील्ड इमिशन वट इज डेफिनेशन ऑफ फील्ड इमिशन द प्रोसेस ऑफ इलेक्ट्रन इमिशन बाय द एप्लीकेशन ऑफ स्ट्रॉन्ग इलेक्ट्रिक फील्ड एट द सर्फेस ऑफ मेटल इज नोन एज इलेक्ट्रिकल इमिशन वेन ए मेटल सर्फेस इज प्लेस्ड क्लोज टू हाई वोल्टेज कंडक्टर हुईज इज पॉजिटिव आर ए ट्री द मेटल सर्फेस द इलेक्ट्रिक फील्ड एक्सट्रैक्ट एट्रैक्टिव फोर्स ऑन द फ्री इलेक्ट्रॉन्स इन द मेटल लुक द फिगर इट्स फ्री इलेक्ट्रॉन्स इट्स इमिटिंग सर्फेस एंड इज द बैसिंग एंड एक्सट्रैक्ट द इलेक्ट्रॉन्स इफ द पॉजिटिव पोटेंशियल इज ग्रेट एनफ इट सक्सेस इन ओवरकमिंग द रिस्टैंडिंग फोर्सेज ऑफ द मेटल सर्फेस एंड द फ्री इलेक्ट्रॉन्स विल बी इमिटेड फ्रॉम द मेटल सर्फेस एज शोन एज फिगर दिस लाइक इट्स पोटेंशियल बैरियर इज पॉजिटिव पोटेंशियल इज ग्रेट इट सक्सेस फुली ओवरकमिंग एंड रिस्ट्रेक्टेड द इलेक्ट्रॉन फ्लोइंग द इलेक्ट्रॉन एंड द फ्री इलेक्ट्रॉन्स विल बी इमिटेड very intense electric field required to produce field emission usually a voltage usually a voltage plus 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 is this voltage in order the million voltage part central distance between the emitting surface and the positive conductor is necessary to cause field emission field emission can be obtained the temperature much lower than required for harmonic emission and therefore it's also sometimes called cold cathode emitter and or it's called auto electronic emission so we uh, look again it's barrier and the barrier connected are free electrons and the free electrons if positive they are throwing the, the potential is grating as the greater metal and surface and free electrons will be the metal uh, and its restricting force and they incoming the emitting surface and their prospective view usually a voltage and these are voltage level secondary emission electron emission from a metallic surface by the bombardment of high speed electrons or other particles is known as secondary emission when high speed electrons suddenly strike a metallic surface they may give some or all of their kinetic energy to the free electrons in the metal look it's primary electrons and its secondary electrons and its electron source and they are incoming in this area and its this area uh, and uh, its uh, secondary electrons and it is called primary electrons so we uh, the metallic surface look this uh, area and they may keep some or all their kinetic energy in electrons is sufficient it may cause free electrons to escape from the metal surface this phenomenon is called secondary emission the electrons that strike the metal are called primary electrons like that primary electrons and like that secondary electrons the intensity of electron of uh, em secondary emission depends upon emitter material secondary emission is depend depend emitter materials mass and energy all are mass energy and bombarding particles the principle of secondary emission is insulated 
and cover it glass involved this this like glass involved this and this same condition same area same equipments primary electrons secondary electrons this like glass area it's same it's glass involved area and it's a electron path it, uh, first uh, figure we see uh, its electron source secondly we look its sun and it's also a electron source it's like that light source and uh, they gives a two path is electron path and some energy and it's make a glass area the principle of secondary emission in insulated this figure and this figure and evaporated glass envelope contains and contains the emitting surface and the source of primary electrons are the encoding maintained at positive potential wrt this is called wrt the emitting surface and we look this area the first terminal and second terminal they are connected a to a battery this like a battery is negative side and this are positive side positive side contains make the point of a area and various area or anode area and the negative terminal is go the electrons area and it's all the electrons it's electrons 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 and there uh, this uh, uh, picture symboling the electron path and this making a glass area and the source of light source uh, there contribute anode and con contribute the flow of current it's all the energy incoming and the battery and the flowing of the current this current may be measured by connecting a sensitive galvanometer and the uh, the anode circuit the effect of secondary emission are very undesirable the many electronic device for example in a tetroid bulb secondary emission is responsible for the negative resistance in some electronic device however secondary emission effect or utilize electric multiplier cathode ray tube it is a so we uh, look all of our uh, pictures and and we know that the emission field emission and the secondary emission um, so its cause and uh, its area its source it's may be uh, very effect uh, to uh, in, uh, day by day in our relative area when it's high speed electrons is suddenly incoming and its metallic surface they give some all at the kinetic energy we again say the effect of secondary emission is very uh, effective in our electronic device so we thinking it and our device and helpful and all over the photoelectric division secondary emission field emission is all are uh, the our uh, the community life is effect effects are utilized in electro multiplier all the devices so finally uh, can be used the the simplify power requirements or most the modern receiving tubes is very helpful thank you for today.